Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here back in Old War Blues as we're continuing to play as Kaisar's Legion. So last time, yesterday actually, I should apologize for the re-upload of yesterday's video and still the first 10 seconds were very blurry at low resolution, about 360p for some reason, but eventually it kick kicks back up into 1080p for the resolution throughout the rest of the video. I'm not sure why I did that, my original video, um... I still have it. It's actually perfectly fine. It's at 1080p throughout the entire thing, including the first 10 seconds. I'm not sure what's happened with it, but all I can say it was it was not on my side when uploading the video. I mean, if I could show you the video itself, I mean, it, it looks totally fine. It looks exactly, hopefully, like this video. But regardless, I do apologize for the unintended upload at and then the lack of a good resolution yesterday. So anyways, for today... I'm calling an audible, so I'm thinking of our future decisions. Right now, we're justifying on dead horses, so we can get access to the new Canaanites, basically. The Mormon Alliance. <laughs> However, we could also go to war with the NCR, and if we wait to go to war with the NCR, that'll mean they're only going to be stronger and stronger and stronger, and then we might eventually be fighting a two-front war against the new Canaanites. So, basically, we're going to have to go to war. So, and uh, I might have tested this out a little bit. This line isn't bad, but it's not good. It could be much better. So, I said I wouldn't do this, but I might need a few extra soldiers here. Helping out our Navajo Nation slave warriors. So, they'll spread out. They can help hold the line. We have four ghoul divisions, or really four infantry divisions from the Wither Dogs. Holding the line against Nipton. And down here in Tumbleholm, we will have direct access into attacking Blythe. And taking, well, Blythe. And we can push in just a little bit, so we can station our forces there and maybe exploit the AI. Maybe, maybe not. One thing I am noticing here that we have no air bases. That's a big no-no. How could I let this go without noticing? Because we don't have enough air support. All right, cool. So give me a few days. I even told my ships to stop building up or stop training for now, because I don't need them training. They're going to need help hold the waterways. Give me a few days so that our divisions can reorganize themselves a little bit. Uh, powder gangers were annexed by the NCR. The powder gangers were actually right over here, so that's good to know. Let you guys get all situated. Very nice. I will separate those divisions soon enough. My goal is just to push through Tumble Home. Because if we wait too long, we might get stuck in a two-front war. And I don't want that. So my Praetorian Guards, you're going to come back down here under Legat Lanius. Beautiful. Uh, we could use another army group. Another army... Uh, army leader. Uh, we can't really do that. Where are you guys stationed? You guys are stationed around Golden Valley. I need more Coast Guard divisions, but they'll be out soon, just not soon enough. Alright, you guys are getting more and more soldiers up there. Uh, it looks like we're good to go. Let's go ahead and try it. Let's see what happens. Call all allies in. Good. Let you guys start ripping the part of the enemies up there. Go ahead in the north near Tumbleholm. Just go ahead and start attacking. I need to make sure we can at least get a good chunk of territory up here. I'm not going to attack this way because they have too many divisions this way, I believe, already. Give me half of you. Try this, Vulpus. You are level 7 general. Oh, no. Nothing here. Um, try that, my friend. And we'll see what happens. Give them an extra little push. We need a good... And make sure these guys cannot move their divisions either. Looks like they got... They're losing some organization. Right here is very good. Extra divisions... It looks like the Navajo Nation soldiers will need some more help post what we've already given them. Throw them on there. And actually, you militia, you're only eight. I'm going to throw you on the coasts already. And then you, special forces, 10, throw you over there. And then you're 20 with, you're not bad. Well, just throw you on to... Here, that'd be good. I'm really just focused on the the so southern portion, really. That's where most of my attention is going to be given. Uh, we ah, we're probably going to lose a little bit of territory up here. That's fine. Call up the chariots. <clears throat> They're still attacking us like crazy up here. Uh, we can pierce them, which is good. Which means if we want to help shore up the line, if we're going to lose some territory, they're going to lose some territory as well. It's give and take, shake and bake. Uh, we're not winning here anymore, which isn't good. We might win here, which will be good for us. We'll see what happens. I'm going to keep it going for right now. Uh, we lost a tile. Not really surprising. Especially if we can take that tile back. Or take that tile from them. 
In return. Oh, it sounds like there's a naval invasion. West Arizona. Uh, shippies. All of my ships. Go ahead and do some convoy raiding here. You're probably not going to survive very long, but we'll see what happens. Good. We're doing okay around here. That's good. Um, you guys are getting attacked. That's good that you're holding. You guys are down here, which is good as well. Go ahead. Get rid of this line. We don't need that for now. Uh, they took two tiles while well, we're still attacking for this one. You can stop attacking. You can move uh, one guy that way. One guy up here. I think, you know, they're going to keep attacking. I understand. That's totally fine with me. You guys can stop attacking over here, though. If we can push over here, that'd be great. And then I'm going to have you guys stop attacking as well. You'll finish up whatever you're doing right now. And if you can tell, my nose is a little bit stuffy. Um, yeah. Go ahead and finish the, what you're doing off right now. You 13, you're going to come over here. Only 13. I want the other guys to be stationed right here as well. That'll be good. Very nice. You two can come. Uh, let's pause it. Let's pause it. You basically do the same thing. Half of you will come down here, though. Good, good, good. You're getting attacked. That's okay. Nice. Not bad. I mean, the, this northern portion, definitely going to be a problem. But, yeah, we'll see what happens. Uh, if you help them attack, you can just get that stuff back. Um, they're abandoning the post in the north. So it's actually kind of good for us. You guys are doing fine. Convoys. We sunk five of them. We're still engaged in a naval battle with the NCR sol uh, Navy. Not soldiers, but the Navy. Go ahead and help them out there. You guys in the south, you're doing alright. Awesome. We can push finally into here. That'll be good. Uh, yeah, you guys, just go ahead and cut them off here. Oh, we're going to get Hoover Dam back, boys. Awesome. Very, very good. Oh, uh, we're sinking. Oh, look at those ships. Beautiful. Uh, where's the rest of our ships? Go ahead. Everyone just go ahead and repair. Because we only have a single battle cruiser. Now, Kaisar, he's not known for having a great fleet. But it's going to be whatever we can take. Or whatever we can manage or build. Uh, Vulpus, you did a great job. Great job, Vulpus. Um, where are you guys at? You're still up there. That makes sense. I'm probably going to split this force up eventually. Don't worry about attacking for right now, guys. Don't worry about it. Just try to mostly defend. That's the main goal right now. Uh, over here. You guys are doing fine. Nipton. We might just be able to break across to Nipton. Yep, it looks like we might just be able to. Good. Uh, send half you guys to help them out take here. Send half you guys to come out here. We got a few more divisions. Mostly soldiers from the with the dogs. Thank you for joining us. Thank you very much. Uh, you guys might not actually be able to take that. That would not be very good. Um, yeah, go ahead and hold. If we don't take that, that's fine. We'll just come around through Hoover Dam. Bonelli Landing, take good springs. Go to the long 15. Awesomeness. Real good stuff. Where are you guys? You guys are over there. You guys are over here. And you guys are up the north. So really, we just need Port Aradesh. That's really what we need. And I'm going to keep throwing soldiers in there because we need that spot. So we can make one big fallback. One big front line, actually. Now, uh, we could take uh, UT-95, but I'm thinking... Nah, right now. Go ahead and take Hoover Dam. We need those resources. Uh, we probably won't be able to get this, which is unfortunate. So, you guys have done a great job. Do that. That would be great. Awesome stuff. Awesome, you guys can hold for now. I'm going to let my forces build up down here so that the NCR thinks that they might be able to win, but of course they will not. Go ahead, add another one in there. Alright guys, seriously, just take Benelli Landing. I'm going to send you a, a scouting soldier, scouting division, see if you can push up. As the NCR is attacking me in the Valley of Names. Vulpus, you're doing a great job. I am getting a little worried that he might be getting a little bit too much experience, but... Ooh. Oh, we're out of basic weaponry? Oh! Well, that's not good. What do we have a lot of? We have a lot of explosive equipment. Spec Ops. 
All right, explosive and spec ops. Um, that's better. Explosive and spec ops. Oh, we're not even making any spec ops stuff. All right, cool, whatever. Um, port Eridesh. Yeah, guys, don't worry about that. I also have some coffee here, so I'm drinking up quite a bit, quite a bit of a stir. And we took Nipton. Great. Our glory knows no bounds. Go ahead and cut off whatever divisions there, there might be up here. That's good. That's good stuff. Well, Pess, you're doing a great job. Truly a great job. All right. No, I put extra divisions here. Didn't really need to, I guess. But let's go ahead and get to the long 15 first and see what happens. Um, You guys, make sure that they cannot move that way. You just come to the good springs. Thank you, NCR, for taking out the powder gangers. That was great of you to do that for us. Oh, and here come some more ships trying to kill off enemy ships. Uh, actually, you guys get up out here. Oh, auto injectors sound very good for an army that's marching. Oh, that looks really good as well, though. Um, recon, I don't think I'm, I'm even using recon at the moment. Of course, our land doctrine is already done. Specialized doctrine, aerial warfare, special forces. Uh, I'm not really using them too much at the moment. It's 2279. Uh, bonuses and stuff like that sounds good and all, but yeah. Hmm. Infantry stuff. At a time. Warrior equipment. Sounds good to me. We've taken quite a few losses, so have they. We've lost a destroyer. Okay, okay. Not not bad. Not bad. We're getting attacked pretty harshly down in the deep south. There, we're getting... Oh, crap. Oh! Oh! Look at all these uh, Coast Guard divisions we got now. Nice. We're going to need more, though. It'll never be enough. I will always need more, 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 and more. An unfortunate reality. Yeah, just keep abusing them. <laughs> Not sure how, how else I'm supposed to characterize it as, but just keep taking what they got. For you guys, go ahead and hold. Just hold back the line for now. And I realize it's paused, so. Uh, Y'all, just hold on here. Hold on here. We'll get there eventually. Um, we might be able to attack here. Oh, do you see that? Oh no, they have power armor. Oh goodness. Sounds like I'm going to need some serious air support down here then. Oh, Lanius, you've fallen ill. That's not good for us. We need more stability, though, right now. Let's do that. What are we building? We're building another civilian factory, or civilian workshop. Some scrap, as well. That's not bad. That's not bad whatsoever. I, really, I don't need more factories. I just need more resources. So, so... Flagstaff is going to get a little bit of a boost to its resource capabilities. And I love purebred mutts. Every legionary, a hound. Oh, yes. Military training. Give me that soft attack and suppression bonus. Oh, I love suppression. Um, y'all don't... Oh, we lost a battle there. All right, you guys do that. You guys do that for now. The rest of y'all, just go ahead and hold. Don't need to worry about it too much. Get that over here. I'll replace uh, in time. I w well, actually, I guess right now. U24 stack will come over here. And you will hold. I Once those guys are up there, I will pull out these Weathered Dogs divisions. And I'll move them somewhere else. Oh, Pioneer kits. Nice. Special Force Platoon Armor. Sure, why not? We could use maybe slightly, slightly more armor. Oh, we're getting attacked down here. That's not good. Send half of your best soldiers down here. Centurion Magnus. Uh-oh. Nice. Sunk a couple more ships. Canoe hull. Uh, go ahead and repair. I'm being very careful with the Navy. Very, extremely careful. Nice. Very good. Withered Dogs. Alright, so the Wither Dogs, you can now pull off since the supply down here isn't going to be very great. I'm going to go ahead and position 
my withered dog divisions down here because I knew we would get navally invaded somewhere. Um, let you all come down here as well. That would be great. Are we getting navally invaded anywhere else? I hope not. Uh, but I knew something like this would happen, so I'm not really surprised. Uh, but you guys, yep, you are actually already here. Nice. Yeah, just stay there. Let the enemy tire themselves out. Actually, you know what? Just in case, I'll send you down here too. We'll let the NCR think that they have the capabilities for defending that area. Oh! I still have more planes down here. Yeah, you guys come over here and help out down here. Also, yeah, you guys are doing fine over here. That's good. Good stuff. So they're getting attacked. Yeah, it's going to be a real problem with NCR navally invading me, but we will work on that. Because for the most part, they can't beat us. At least when we're defending. Ah, very good. Tasty stuff. Purpose for Pecos. Aluminum production. Um, infrastructure, arms workshops, civilian workshops. That's not bad. I, I will do all of these focuses eventually, of course. Enslaving the colonists sounds like fun. More cores sounds like fun. Infrastructure. Let's do infrastructure because that might get us more resources. So, the Via Militaris was once the greatest system of roads in the ancient world, and in, in its honor, we shall forge a new system of roads in the ruins of that world, stretching to all corners of our young. Empire. Ah, uh, yes. Also, I will let you know, I have been playing uh, another game lately. Not just Hoi 4, not just The Outer Worlds. But in my own time, I've been experimenting with another game. Hold on, I'm about to sneeze. <laughs> um, I have been playing the game called... That hasn't been received extremely well, but you know, it's, it is what it is. Imperator Rome. I have been playing that as... Actually, a barbarian nation, not as Rome. I tried out Rome. Rome was okay. Been trying to play as a barbarian nation, the Varnia, Varinia, something like that. Trying it out. I'm actually having a little bit of fun with it. Not bad. But, uh. But yeah, I have also been playing in the good old times. The times where everyone died by the time you, they were usually by 30, and there's a lot of barbarian, barbarian killing, as well as Roman killing, too. Oh. I guess it looks like that last naval battle that we weren't paying attention. Didn't do so well for us. Huh. And here was me, trying to be more tactical with my navy. Well, crud. Oh well. What's done is done. I can't take away the past. All we can do is learn from it and push forward. And like this. Go ahead. I need you guys out immediately. You guys can always get more uh, strength back later on. Uh, you guys you guys can just help defend for now. That's totally fine with me. Uh... Lucius. I love Lucius. He's a great, great military leader. Oh, we need someone here, too. Centurion Dickus! Dickus! See Dickus! I love it! I love the Dickus! Ah. Nothing like Dickus to help us win military campaigns. Dickus Maximus. Ah, he will be a great leader. Yeah, I'm just at this point. I'm just kind of letting the AI just kind of kill themselves. I want to see how high my uh, Volpus's skill can get. Halfway to level seven. Let's see. He's got another uh, trait he could do. He's adaptable. He's a very very smart individual. He's an ex very good logistic uh, person. Like his logistic skill is super high. Every time I see this flag, I think of North Korea. Oh crap! Hold on. We might be overextending. Maybe it's a little bit too much. You guys are wrapping up down there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and tell you to stop moving so hard. Because while you're doing an extremely good job, my Navajo Nation um, friends, as well as, well, slaves, and my legions, I'm going to need to tell you to calm down a little bit. That'll be good. Because I don't want to move too far until we can take this area as well. Uh, planes. Plane-wise, you're doing a great job. But down here might... Eh, they already have some planes. Do they have an airbase around here at all? It doesn't really look like it. That's disappointing. I'll send you, though, south. To up here. Oh, right then. Very good. I might be able to bait the enemies into attacking me if I leave a couple divisions alone. Uh, what are the casualties so far? It sounds like we're getting navally invaded again. Oh, shisa. 
Yeah, the NCR, I mean, holy crap. They are going all sorts of different areas here. Um, Praetorian Guards, uh, actually, I really can't get rid of my soldiers for right now for that. If anything, we need to try to push this area out. So, we need to definitely keep on the offensive for now. Uh, you five, actually, you know what, you five can probably hold off this area, not too bad, and they don't have a lot of divisions around here, which is good, they do have a port over there, which is bad, down here, obviously, they've taken some territory, uh, this is why I spammed out those divisions earlier, good, go ahead, just keep holding, what are the casualties like, not bad, yeah, only a thousand, not bad, whatsoever, a little better than I thought, well, actually, quite a bit better than I thought. <clears throat> so, for here, we need to take this port. That's the main goal. That port is necessary for us to take and just keep. So, take this spot if we can. <clears throat> and then push south. Because it looks like a lot of divisions actually aren't around here. Um, how are you doing? Six. Go and hold. Give me half of y'all. Take port Aradesh. We gotta get port Aradesh. Go ahead and do that. That'll be good. If we can take that, that would be the best thing that possible. Because we got a little fluffy stuff we gotta take care of. We'll probably over here eventually, too. Um, Where are you guys at? You're attacking over here, white dogs. You're kind of getting attacked. You're ty kind of attacking. This won't matter as much if we can just take out most of the industrial base of the NCR. And once we get this, I'm gonna start reorganizing our legions and making sure that we can take care of any given situation. Ah, radio detection. Nothing says radio detection like Kaiser's legion. Let's go and do some more research speed. This is looking good. This is not looking good whatsoever, but Gente del Sol. Uh, actually, that's not good at all because they already gave me all their divisions. Actually, that's very bad. Uh, you guys, go ahead. I'll maybe start manually having you attack in certain areas. Uh, planes, actually. Oh, you still need the planes up here, because you are getting attacked kind of hard now. Come on, take Port Aradesh. Oh, more divisions. Ah, oh, very nice. Since we've already built this up, I don't mind throwing you under the here. I did say I was going to separate these guys, but... Uh, these times call for desperate measures. Alright, so you, you can attack and be successful there. That's unfortunate. Save one guy there. Immediately attack for the port. We need the port no matter what happens. You go ahead and hold. Because if they get another port, then they it won't be very good for us down here. This, however, is looking better and better. Nice. You can come up there. And then you guys have done a great job. Thank you, my chariots. This is why I have motorized chariots. And then I'll send them back to the west. Port Aradesh, come on. I still need you guys. They don't have that... Oh, like, actually, they do have quite a few divisions over there. Uh, oh, crap. We got encircled. That's not good. Immediately send a res rescue team that way. Immediately send yourself back up north. Um, go ahead and start shrinking the line just a little bit more. Go ahead and try to get out of here. We gotta break free. And not much is happening because... Ooh, we have military training. Hmm, that's okay for now. Land doctrine's good. Let's get some more ballistic fists. Good. Don't ever want to overextend ourselves. But we might be able to attack here in Blythe. Because we got 17... Actually, I'm just going to attack Blythe proper. Because we might be able to circle those guys. That would be very cool. Nice, we got the port. That's great. We just need to take this city, this village, before they can do too much else. Because they won't be able to get too much more resources if we do this. So be careful in attacking, guys. Don't be too crazy. Don't be too crazy. Good, we've rescued these soldiers. Go ahead and hold whatever you need to hold. And push these guys out of here. Uh, actually, I want you to go this way. Push the, through them. Um, actually, you know what? Send this division. Take this, and see if you can do an encirclement. If they die, then they die. Great. Greatness. Awesome. 
All right, soldiers, I need you back over here. And I need you back over here. Actually, you know what? I'm going to keep you guys in the back. Send the motorized down here for now, just because I might need them. If we can take Blythe, that would be great. Awesome, we've surrounded the power armor. And they will die accordingly. Beautiful. Truly beautiful. Help slow them, slow their advances down. And they're trying to naval invade me up here. Oh, god dang it. Really? That many? Hmm. Hmm. I don't want to deploy unready legions. That's bad management. But I do what I must. That might just be enough to help stop the invasion, because that's a lot of soldiers they're sending in. Um, next up. New Mexico highways. The people of New Mexico were slow to kneel, and travel through this place is rough even for our best warriors and outrunners. If trade is to flourish, and if our armies are to move swiftly through these places, we shall need more roads. Awesome. We have another research thing we could do. Cowboy repeater. That sounds like fun. Um, division training time, defense. Ooh, let's do that. Militia training. Oh, yeah, and you're doing that. Ah, uh, come on, I need port air dash. I mean, that's like the key to everything here. Blythe, please take Blythe. Not doing so well up here. Losses, 2,000 versus 15,000. That's nice. For us. Not for them, but for us. Oh, you guys are moving around. Good. Give me half of y'all. Continue the attack. No matter what happens, you keep attacking. You guys are defending great. Great, 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 great. We're doing the best we can with our withered dogs. Thank God I actually took some of my pup, uh, puppets divisions. God dang it, we can't get this tile just yet. So be it. We will massacre whoever comes in our way then. You guys come over here then. Good. Puppets will make a massacre out of you. If you guys are doing okay, give them more attack. I need this taken now. Oh, and you guys did great over here in the north. Thank you. The Navajo Nation, you were doing sometimes better than what I wanted you to. Great. Come on. Awesome. Immediately give them no quarter. And crucify half of them when they have learned their lesson. Uh, they're still attacking us. We're still kind of winning, though. We're definitely winning in Genta del Sol. I am the savior of Genta del Sol after I annex them. Free fire declared war on the cartel. Well, sounds like that's exactly what Mexico could use nowadays. Ooh, you're not winning right there, which is not good. Oh, uh, yeah, you guys are still over here. I'm just going to make you into a, an army right now. I'll put you under command of someone new. Centurion Rufinus. Rufinus, glad to meet you. Don't lose. It's not going to end very well for you if you lose. Uh, it's still... Hmm, strip power armor. Recon kits. Hmm... Even better doggos. I believe, think. I think so. Nice. Life is ours. Go do that. There's no way these three divisions can send up to my 17. Awesome. And you know what, for now, since nothing's going... Oh, never mind. Stuff is going on over here now. I was going to send this this way, but whatever. Oh, wait. We have a... Battle cruiser. Awesome. Oh my goodness, look at the pathetic degenerate attempt to invade my southwestern border has failed miserably. Absolutely miserably. And you know what? There will be no peace, there will be no quarter for those of you who do this. Thousands of men have been lost and wasted for what? Nothing. Nothing stands in the way of the Kaiser. Look at this. Defend the village all you like, but in the end, you'll be nothing but dust. Beautiful. With the dogs, you have earned a place in the Legion. Um, next up. Rhodey Swords. The northern lands have been secured. We shall bring them into the Legion's grasp. Let trade and slaves flow south, even as our armies flow northward. Let them know what it means to be part of something greater. And then I will do Divide et Impera, which will be very important for us, and then do this. But I want to see if we can get more uh, roads. And yeah, maybe re more resources. Let's see. It seems like we're not doing too bad on resources now, which is very nice to see. Um, concerning this, soldiers. Most soldiers. 
Oh, they actually landed. Well, weather dogs are coming back up north. Uh, that's really not good. Go ahead and try to hold them in place. We will take try to take Port Eredesh eventually. Um, you, you have no screens. Go home. Like, seriously, I don't want to lose you immediately. You've already killed four enemy destroyers. Oh, their enemy fleets are showing up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. Get out of there. Get out of there. Uh, get to the destroyers. There's destroyers in uh, Phoenix. Or Flagstaff. No, that's Phoenix. That's Phoenix. Port Eridesh. Very nice. Ah, another Navajo Nation member. Great. Beautiful. Uh, let you guys come up north. I might need the Praetorian Guard to help stamp these degenerates out. Mm, not Republic of the Rio Grande. They're still fighting down here. Nueva Atlan against a Jaguar cult. Max Maximilian, no. Santa Ana is struggling a little bit with Petro Chico. Good. The failed attack is going just as I planned. Just. Uh oh. Tlaloc's demise. Let's listen. Happy Halloween. <laughs> awesome. You guys are doing a great job. Go ahead and attack that way. Four more legions. You are here. Go ahead and give these guys no quarter, no rest. Oh, we're getting attacked over here like crazy. Holy cow. Mm, if we lose any spot, we still will be okay. We can't get encircled from any one spot here right now. Let them believe that they are doing okay. No more naval invasions for now. This spot is a little concerning, but it won't be the end of the world. Now, Centurion Magnus is doing a great, great job. I'm trying to cut off these guys. Cut them off here and then move our soldiers maybe a little bit further south and cut around Port Eredesh. That is the goal. Good. Let's cut these soldiers up. Now, you. You can focus on this border. And... Centurion Deodatus. Now you can force all your soldiers over here to help hold the line. Restructure ourselves a little bit. Ah, uh, good. Sending more divisions to help out. Good stuff. Up here we didn't take things yet, but now we are ready to fully exterminate the vermin. Looks like you could use another general. Centurion Fabric Fabricius. Cross road eastwards. Very nice. Divide at Impera. Divide at Impera or divide and conquer is a principle of dividing a larger power into smaller powers in order to better conquer or rule over the parts. By attacking key areas of the NCR, we can weaken them enough to be more easily conquered. So get less max planning, which will be good for us. Oh, and what are we building? Uh, we're just repairing things. Oh, the Western Brotherhood actually won and the Xi lost. That's really not a surprise to anyone who's been paying attention. Uh, let's build some more scrap factories. And... Dockyards, that's not bad. I need more resources, really. Phoenix. Do we have any more water? Over there, and then... Ah. Yeah, we'll do that, and we'll do that, too. Very nice. I'll do that. Cool. Happy 2280, my friends. Oh, did they... Are they beginning to abandon the line? Because if they are... Good. Very good. They are attacking, or we are supposed to be attacking over here. This is not good. If we get it, we lose this tile. That's not good whatsoever. Um, we might be able to push right here though. Maybe, perhaps. Uh, good. We actually have two battle cruisers now. That's surprising, and I like it, and I love it. Uh, over here, I'm purposely letting this video go on a little bit longer than normal because I want to do a lot of this right now. If we need to shrink the line, so be it. It looks like we, we're going to need to. Go ahead, come up this way, guys. Make your way up that way. If they take this area over, I mean, that's not really any sort of loss. I just got to make sure that we can defend properly and we can concentrate our forces where we need to concentrate them. More with their dogs? Great. Oh, 
Oh, we, we took the fort, but we didn't take anything else. That's alright. Ah, oh, Centurion Dickus. I love it. Good stuff. Losses, 29,000. Very nice. I wonder what the equipment stockpile of the NCR is currently. Uh, here we might be able to win. Let's try it. Here we might be able to win as well. Give me half of you guys to attack. Give me the other five to attack this way as well. That might divert soldiers away from Port Eridesh. And if that is the case, great. Um, Industry stuff. Yes, advanced tools. Good. Slowly winning in some key areas. If I could push up this way, that would be great. But I don't want to lose too many soldiers. If I have to lose this, like I said, that's totally fine with me. Uh, don't move yet. Don't move yet. Uh, let's go over to industry. Rapid prototyping. Oh, we are starting to get crushed a little bit. Go ahead and move up. Go ahead and hold. Don't worry about it. This is just a quick little bit of restructuring that we need to do. Come here, come here, come here. Losses. They are suffering some extreme losses. And that is great. You guys helping out down there. Port Eridesh. You are attacking me? That is a terrible move for you. Because if you attack, I will attack you in the booty. Anywhere else that we're getting attacked. Doesn't look like it. Awesome. Cybernetic enhancements. Awesome. Uh, we're doing that. Let's get some more construction speed. Building some more stuff up. I love it. Oh, they took that tile. That's not good. Uh, Port Eridesh. Go ahead and keep pummeling them down there. Awesome. Ships. Well, with two battle cruisers now, I feel a little bit more confident in doing this. Go ahead and don't worry about the line, my friends. Do not worry about the line. Just go ahead and move up north. We must make sure that we are taken care of properly. That is fine with me. This is all of a tactical move maneuver. It's all a tactical maneuver, my friends. Don't worry about attacking. No, 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 no. Don't worry. Got quite a bit of army XP now. Because Port Aradesh is the most important thing. They get less max planning. We get miniaturized circuitry. Ooh. New California Republic. Less stability, but more war support. Volpus and Kota has come to us with a plan. The NCR camp in the town of Searchlight could be easily sabotaged by opening some irradiated barrels of nuclear waste inside the town, irradiating the town and the soldiers within. Good job, Volpus. Good job. Better reinforce rate. Thank you. We took it. Port Aradesh is ours. Now, time for some restructuring. You guys. Centurion, Deodatus, and Volpus. You're going to merge away from... Uh... Lanius, or not Lanius, but Lucius for right now. We need Primus, Primus, Nerva. Oh, Unyielding Defender, nice. Uh, I can't do that. Yep, that's okay with me. Uh, where are y'all at? Oh, you're down here. Go ahead and hold. Do not worry about attacking right now. Restructure yourself so that you can guard the entire line. And then we'll be able to push south very, very well. God dang it, guys. I, I don't want you to get encircled. Seriously, get the hell away from here. No, come on. Come on, game. I know you're a little laggy. <clears throat> I need you to move up as well. Come on, move. Get rid of this. Do not come up here yet. You're crazies. Uh, and have you six hold for now. Just because I don't want to get encircled. Uh, come on. Now, everyone leave. Get attacked and leave. Do not move. Do not move. Whatever you do, do not move. Alright, so. That's much better. This is much more manageable now. That's good. That's what I want you to do. Maybe I should have abandoned that post, but whatever. Awesome. So, we have concentrated our forces quite quite well, I would say. You are over here. You are over there, which maybe I should move you back up here. And then I'll have another front line up here as well. Yeah, that would probably, probably be for the best. We haven't been navally invaded anywhere else. We are doing pretty darn well. We've only lost 5,000 men in total. 
including our own puppets, and we've killed 36,000 degenerates. Truly amazing. With a little bit of ingenuity, we can do whatever needs to be done. Go ahead and help attack here. Awesome. Good, good stuff. Let them think they can win. And we're suffering no attrition. Really beautiful. Now, if the Brotherhood of Steel, could you please attack the NCR? That would be great. That would be actually really, really, really great. But, anyways, I think that's all the time for that we have today. It's about 40 minutes into this video, which is not bad. Not bad whatsoever. So, if you enjoyed the video, <clears throat> excuse me, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Um, check out my Discord link below. I apologize for the beginning of yesterday's video. And I will see you all tomorrow as we might be able to crush the NCR. And I hope you all have a great, great day.